The United States is expected to top 100,000 deaths related to COVID-19 any day now. And health experts continue to say the single best way to keep that number from going up is to keep our distance from one another. If you got on social media over the weekend, we saw so many videos from that time period that show yeah. Cheryl people are not doing that. Bars in Georgia are supposed right. to stay closed till the end of the month. But there was a lively bar scene over the weekend, the holiday weekend in Atlanta anyway. 11 Alive's Doug Richards takes a look. This is a restaurant and lounge on Ponce de Leon near downtown, which stayed open late Sunday and which seemed to have plenty of company in town. The crowd in this video is not exactly shoulder to shoulder, yet its patrons are certainly numerous with few, if any, masks in sight. We can't verify that this is Boogaloo as the video identifies it, but flyers showed that the facility threw a Memorial Day party Sunday, which lasted from 4 p.m. to midnight. And when asked about it, Boogaloo management told us simply, we are a restaurant. Likewise, this weekend, a thick crowd gathered outside the district of still mostly closed bars on Edgewood Avenue. To bar owners like Johnny Martinez, who owns two night spots there, it illustrates a pent-up demand to reopen. That pressure comes from uh, our customers. It comes from our vendors. It comes from uh, people on staff who are worried they're going to have a job, you know, eight weeks from now, four months from now. Martinez says more than 30 people lost jobs when he closed Joystick Game Bar and the Atlanta Beer Garden. He expects to slowly reopen Joystick next weekend while limiting crowds to keep staff and customers safe. Other night spots are already promoting booze and DJs and yes, even social distancing on flyers. Because you start seeing crowds of people who are looking for a place to go or something to purchase and you know you need to sell something, um, it's just, it makes it harder. The upshot is there is a licensing distinction between a bar and a restaurant in Georgia. A restaurant can open legally while a bar cannot, but some bars have restaurant licenses. So the question is, how far they're willing to go and can go during a health emergency.